स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू दिस सेशन इन दिस सेशन वी लर्न हाउ टू कैलकुलेट द पी एच ऑफ डिफरेंट ए सी डेन बेसिस सो आई हैव कलेक्टेड सम डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ कैलकुलेशन सो इट विली इट विली इजी नॉट ओनली इजी एंड कन्वीनियंट टू कैलकुलेट द पी एच ऑफ डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ ए सी डेन बेसिस सो लेट एस सी दैट पी एच ऑफ द स्ट्रॉग ए सी डेन स्ट्रॉग बेस इन अक्वा सोल्यूशन दिस इज द वन टाइप पी एच ऑफ स्ट्रॉग एसिड स्ट्रॉग बेस इन वेरी डायल्यूट अक्वा सोल्यूशन वन इज अक्वा सोल्यूशन वन इज वेरी डायल्यूट अक्वा सोल्यूशन थर्ड इज पी एच ऑफ द वीक एसिड वीक बेस इन अक्वा सोल्यूशन पी एच ऑफ द पॉलीप्रोटिक एसिड और बेसिस मीच विच कैन डोनेट प्रोटोन्स और विच कैन डोनेट ओ एच माइनस और पॉलीहाइड्रोक्सिलिक बेसिस पी एच ऑफ द एम्फीप्रोटिक सिस्टम्स पी एच एट आइसो इलेक्ट्रिक पॉइंट सो दीज आर द डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ पी एच यूजली आस्ट इन द board as well as competition examinations so let us see one by one uh, so let us take the first one ph of the strong acid in aqueous solution so this is the one case number 1 so calculate the ph of this is a one value 0.01 molarity of hcl b is a 0.00 0.005 molarity of h2so4 and c is the 10 per minus 4 molarity in normality hcl on h2so4 so here in this question one thing is very important that Uh, volume is fixed. Volume is fixed means volume is equal to one liter. If the volume is less than one liter or more than one liter, the calculation will be different. For one liter, I am just asking. This is the volume one liter. Nothing is given. Only the molarity given means one liter is there. S L equal to S plus S plus and C L minus. So concentration of S plus will be point zero one. This is a strong electrolyte. So we can write S plus is ten to ten to the power minus two. So P H will be directly two. Similarly, in case of 0.05 molar to H2O support, B H2O support, it is dissociated into 2H plus and S sulfate. So this is the initial concentration is 0.005 molar T. So since they are giving 2H plus ion, since this H2O support is 2H plus ion, so we have to write uh, this concentration will be double. So total H plus will be if you multiply this and this, it becomes 0.001 molar T or 10 to the power minus 3 molar T or pH equal to minus log of H plus concentration. If you solve it, so you will get three. So in this case, pH of the uh, this concentration of H2O support is three. In this case, we can see HCl is dissociated into H plus and Cl minus. So in concentration of HCl is 10 to the power minus four. Normality. So normality molarity in this case is equal because the n factor is one because they are giving one, only one H plus. So we can write normality or molarity same. So H plus is 10 to the minus 4 normality and pH equal to this is the formula put this value of concentration n here so you will get minus minus 4 so you will get this 4 value pH equal to 4. Similarly, if you find the find the H2 support 2H plus and sulfate 2 minus so see here here also n factor is uh, so here you can say n factor 2 but here in case in this case what happens we have taken normality so already the factor has been utilized so we cannot write Two uh, into ten to power minus four normality. So if you are writing like this thing, so this will be your wrong. Okay, because in case of normality, you have to use this value as it is. Because already we have taken the whole concentration. This is the whole concentration of two H plus. Because in case of molarity, just we have seen earlier also in case of molarity, so we have taken two into point triple zero five. So molarity is different. So this is the concentration of H plus. In case of molarity, this is the total concentration of H plus whatever the value. So again, we write the same value, and the, you will get the by solving the log value, you will get the pH equal to four. Now case two, pH of the strong base in aqueous solution. So here we have uh, three examples: 0.1 molarity sodium hydroxide, 0.001 molarity barium hydroxide, and 0.001 normality sodium hydroxide. We will do in the same fashion. Sodium hydroxide is dissociated into sodium plus and OH minus. So this is the 0.01. Molarity. So here concentration OH is 0.01 molarity. That is that is 10 to the power minus 1. So POH is equal to minus log of OH minus. This is by definition. So OH is this much value. Substitute this value. So we'll get here one value. So this is the POH. So what is the pH? pH is 14 minus pH. That is 13. So this is the best barium hydroxide. It is dissociated into barium 2 plus and 2 OH minus. So initial concentration is 0.01, but this is 2 hydroxyl ion. So this becomes 2 into 0.01 concentration. So total will be your 2 into 10 to the power minus 3 molarity. So pH is equal to substitute this value 2 into 10 to the power minus 3, and after solving, so you will get value 2.73 minus 
3 that is this value so this is the poh this is the poh value so ph is 14 minus poh that is 11.3 value this is our answer so in case of this one 0 0.01 normality of sodium hydroxide so they will give you this is the initial concentration 10 power minus 3 normality so in this case what will happen so here concentration pH equal to log of OH minus so this is this concentration and minus 1 minus 3 so you will get pH equal to 3 uh, pH equal to 14 minus 3 this is 11 so if you take here 0 0.01 normality of barium hydroxide also okay so you will get the same concept because in case of normality the concentration of uh, of uh, this concentration is same as in case of barium hydroxide also because already normality has been taken if you take the molarity then in case then in that case you have to write 2 into OH so this is the basic difference between normality and molarity now let me see the third case that is the mixture of the two same acid same acid means strong acid maybe 2HCl 2H2SO4 2 nitric acid but same acid the 100 ml of solution is made by adding 50 ml of 0.1 normality HCl and 0 0.01 normality of HCl so these are two same acid but different type of volume one is 100 ml means one i am taking 50 ml and in his this is also 50 ml but concentrations are different so total h plus is nothing but the sum of acid acid so here we will add the total number of h plus so we will use this formula m1 v1 equal to m2 m plus m2 v2 equal to m3 v3 because here the moles will be different here moles will be different so if you add it moles will be increased and volume will be sum of these two volumes so SCL plus SCL 2 SCL, SCL, so in this concentration is 0.1 normality 50 ml, this is 0.01 normality 50 ml, and this is a 50 plus 50 100 ml, but molarity we don't know after adding. So M1 V1 equal to plus M2 V2 equal to M3 into V1 plus V2. So this is the M1 V1, M2 V2, ML, ML, liter, liter, M3 into again 100 by 1000. So if we solve it, so M3 will be this value. 5 plus 0.5 by 100 so you will get 0 0.055 molarity now we will see the case number 4 pH of a mixture of a two different strong acid so here 200 ml of the 0 0.01 molarity HCl plus 400 ml of the 0 0.01 molarity H2SO4 so this is HCl this is H2SO4 so this is 200 ml and for this concentration 0 0.01 molarity and for this concentration 0 0.01 molarity but in this cases if in terms of molarity you have to take the 2 H plus 2 into 0 0.01 molarity now add the total H plus you have to this is we have to need it we have to need so again we use the same formula M1 V1 plus M2 V2 equal to M3 into V1 plus V2 so again the concept is that so here moles is on adding moles is the just uh, on adding the most will be most of hydrogen will be equal to the most of this third solution also so the m1 is this mole this scl this is the v1 this is the m2 this is the v2 this is the total volume this is the m3 so m3 is equal to if you solve this one you will get here uh, 10 upon 600 or 1 upon 60 molarity so h plus is uh, 10 to the power minus 1 by 6 molarity so you take this value here ph is equal to minus log of this value so if you solve it so it will come here 1 plus log of 6 or you can get 1.78 so you will get the answer 1.78 answer now we will see the pH of the mixture of strong base this is the case number 5 100 ml of 0 0.01 molarity sodium hydroxide and 200 ml of 0 0.01 molarity barium hydroxide so if you add it you, will, you have to do in a similar fashion like the pH of the mixture of the strong acids this is the two strong bases M1 V1 M2 V2 100 ml 200 ml this is the molarity since barium hydroxide so in case of hydroxide 0 0.01 molarity into 2 this we have to take it so here you will get uh, the whole OH will be in this side 10 to the power minus 2 this multiplied by this is the total concentration 10 to the power minus 2 OH and OH is here 2 into uh, 0 0.02 2 into 10 to the power minus 2 so here again if on adding so you will get here m1 v1 plus m2 v2 this is the m1 v1 m2 v2 on adding you will get the third solution the third solution is m3 into v1 plus v2 and total volume is 100 plus 200 that is 300 ml so this into this for m2 is this much v2 is this one m3 is this one so on solving m3 is equal to this value and you will get 1 by 60 molarity 
so poh is how much so poh will be minus log of 1 by 60 on solving you will get 1.78 so ph is equal to 14 minus 1.78 that is 12.22 so this is the answer